Hey, come on. I know it's Monday, but we got a lot of tech news to go through and I need you at your finest. Okay, Shirley, start taking minutes. Who's Shirley? I don't know. With up to four terabytes of massive storage capacity combined with SSD-like performance, Seagate's solid-state hybrid drives are the fastest way to have it all. Looks like Google's Project Aura has a competitor. Circular Devices, a company from Finland, have created Puzzle Phone, a modular phone. It's not nearly as versatile as Aura. You can only switch out the three main components, the main spine holding the LCD screen and speakers, a second module holding the battery and secondary electronics, and the third containing the CPU and camera. Circular Devices hopes to launch the device sometime in 2015, but how many modular phones can we take? I mean, Wheels probably hates this one even more than the Aura. It's stupid! It's gonna fail! See, that's what, that's what I'm talking about. Last week, Sony Pictures offices worldwide were hacked by a group called Guardians of Peace, but we didn't actually see any secret content leaked. Now, five films have spilled onto the web. Fury, which released in October, as well as unreleased films, Annie, Mr. Turner, Still Alice, and To Write Love on Her Arms. Sony suspects that North Korea is behind the attack since the film studio is set to release The Interview, a comedy about assassinating Kim Jong-un. They've hired security firm Mandian to look into the issue and restore their network, so hopefully we'll get to the bottom of this soon. In the meantime, if you torn to the movies, I hope you stare deep into Annie's eyes and think about what you've done. Oh, Annie, I'm so sorry. <gasps> Google Glass, remember that? It's a thing. People used to wear it on their face. Well, we're still a while away from a consumer release, but the Wall Street Journal is reporting that the next version of the headset will feature an Intel processor, which would be slightly more exciting if it still looked like it was going to be a real everyday consumer product. According to the report, Intel plans to promote the device to companies such as hospitals and industrial manufacturers, which is where I said it belonged when I did my review. So yeah, I'm pretty good at predicting things. So if you wanna, if you need some predicting done, just tweet me or something. Ooh, San Pellegrino! It's not, it's, it's a fresca. NCIX's Black Friday sale is still going until December 3rd to be exact, and today only is our Cyber Monday sale, so make sure you go check out the discounts, click here or the link in the description. You won't regret it. All right, that's it for Netling Daily, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. All right, Shirley, did you get all that? Let me see. This is a picture of a unicorn. And a bad one, too. It's really bad. Okay. You know what? You need to leave. Get out. Get out of here. Shirley. Damn it, Shirley. Ah.